So you've been trying to hide column headers and you don't really get it right? Let me show you two ways to do it. One that you probably know, the other one, the best one that you probably don't know. Let's get started. So here I have one column in a table and I'm using the new formatting pane. I really like the new formatting pane. I think it's actually great. So what we're going to do is to make this disappear the traditional way, the way that if you Google this, you probably get. And is I'm going to double click on the column and it'll take you to the formatting options for this element. And then you just change the background color to whatever background you have in the image. I have in this case, you know, lila, so that's the purple, that's the, the color it changes to. And as you can see, it goes away, but this doesn't always work. Depending what is on the background, it will work or it will not. So the best way is to actually truly make it go away. And there is a way to do that. And it has to do with HTML code. I'm going to show you. So I'm going to change this back to black. And I'm going to show you the second method that truly makes it go away. But it's not very, very intuitive. Okay, so what we're going to use comes from HTML. So HTML has a character that has no width. And that has two advantages. The first one is obviously it makes the text go away, but not only makes it go away, also it has no width. So if you want to make that column very, very small for whatever reason, you can, because it will not force you to, to you know, keep the text. There's no text, there's no width. So the Power BI are wondering now, like, how am I going to write the HTML on Power BI? Like, what? It is possible, let me show you. Open your browser and you just write zero width. And here you have a zero width, and this is Wikipedia, the first one, but that's not the one that you want. You want any of the other ones. <laughs> because if you go here, it says Unicode Explorer, you can actually copy it on your clipboard. And once you copy it, you can actually go in here, double click and paste it, press enter, and it'll go away and you can see that it doesn't have any width. The only thing that you see this is because I only have one column and it's sorted by that, but if you have other columns, which you probably would have, then that will go away also. So this is a very, very neat way. Just remember Google zero width character or just zero width, it will probably show, but if it doesn't show just zero width character, you see here zero width character and you will get a ton of resources where you can actually copy paste. According to this website, if you press Alt plus 200 B Alt in Windows, you will be able to reproduce it. I wasn't able to do that in Power BI, so I'm not sure. But you can always come here and copy it and then you're good to go. The headers will be gone. Cool trick, isn't it? So, this is all for today. I will see you again in another video very, very soon.